Hi, David here of Lancaster Honda. And here we've got a 2018 67 plate Honda HRV. Obviously registered at the very start of 2018, being a 67 plate. It's finished in white orchid pearl. It's got the 1.6 diesel engine, which is very well known for getting good miles per gallon. It's an SE Navi, and you've also got the little side steps on the side of it. So it's quite a looker, this one. So starting at the driver's side rear wheel, got a nice diamond cut alloy design. There's a very small amount of wear or tear on it, just there. But again, very, very tiny, not really worth worrying about that one. So as you come down the side of the vehicle, you've got some nice chrome door handles. Again, front wheel, driver's side, usually the cleanest one of the lot. So we've got no wear or tear on that at all. Got no cloud on the headlights either. Once you get around the front, you do get parking sensors along there. So you've got four along the front. As we move around, just zoom into that wheel. Again, no issues to be seen with that one. Side step there, and onto the last wheel. So, moving on to the rear, you've then got four parking sensors along the back. So, one a little higher on each side, two along the bumper molding. And just pop the boot open, make sure it's open. So, one of the seats is already down, you can see it goes near enough completely flat there. So, I'll just block the sun a little bit. So, very practical, also a very large boot as well. And there's a lot of space under the boot floor if you do want to store something under there. Potentially a spare wheel as well will fit in there. As you move around, you can then see how the seat folds so flat. So the base actually folds into the floor. You can also lift up as well. This is Honda's magic seat system. So you can do that with both sides. You can get fairly tall items in the back of the car. So from there, we jump into the front where you've got electric windows all around and electric folding wing mirrors. Then got a little panel just to the right of the steering wheel where you've got an economy button. You've also got your alarm, which is the bottom left, vehicle stability assist, parking sensor and lane departure warning. Once we're inside, we'll just start the engine up. It'll start nice and easy. The mileage is 52,000, so I'll just clear that and show you. 52,045 miles, so pretty much exactly what you'd expect for the age of vehicle. So onto the features inside, you get cruise control with the speed limiter, got some audio controls over on the left hand side, got phone controls just below, over on this hand side, well underneath where your cruise control is, you've then got your trip computer, so that's just that screen on the right there, the one I was flicking through before. Behind the wheel, you've got automatic wipers and lights, so both sides. Then onto the centre screen, with this being a nav model, you do get navigation, it's really nice quality navigation on this one, very clear. Really nice, that one. And then if you go onto the home screen again, you can tap where it says FM in the corner and it shows you all your audio sources there. So I'll just give you a second to take them in. And then moving down from there, you do get dual zone climate control, six speed manual gearbox, and then you've also got electronic parking brake as well. And just underneath, just to finish with, that's where all your devices connect up, so you can keep them out of the way as well. So if there is anything I've missed in this video or any extra info you want, don't hesitate to get in contact and I'll see what we can do to help. Otherwise, thanks for watching. Take care. Bye.